Good morning. Welcome to the Mike and Jen in the Morning Show. I'm Mike. I'm Jen. <laughs> and this is day one, June 1st, of the Haskett RV 2013 trip. Jen, tell us a little bit about our adventures yesterday. Well, we did a lot of riding in the RV. We made it all the way to Tennessee, um, right under Knoxville. At the KOA campground. Yes. And the man was very helpful when we got there. He was so helpful, he just hung around for like 20 minutes. <laughs> we couldn't get rid of him. Telling us at 11 o'clock at night, telling us, uh, well, we've got cable wire if you want one. You know, I'm, we're all good, buddy. So, uh, what else? Uh, we went through a tunnel, the kids' first tunnel. That was exciting. So, so you're telling all our viewers about a tunnel. I don't like a tunnel. It was fun. Okay. We also saw mountains. Lots of mountains. Lots of mountains. Beautiful mountains. Hey, Roy, did Jen mention the mountains while on our trip? Oh, I think she said mountains and flowers about 50 times, but I don't know. I'm, who's counting? All about the, the flowers growing out of the rocks. So what are you really talking about flowers growing There's lots of flowers growing out of rocks. Out of the rocks. They were beautiful. They wild were flowers. Wild flowers. Beautiful. And Max reminded us that, our, that I said, I was trying to ask why flowers grow out of rocks, that that was impossible. I was going to try to give a lesson to the kids about dust settlement, and once the dust settles in the rocks, the flowers can grow. But Max says, Miss Hall says it's possible. So, I don't know. That's Tom. <laughs> okay, I guess this is turning to Mike and Jen and Tom in the morning show. Good morning. Good morning. All right, so let's get to the subject at hand. How did everybody sleep last night? Uh, good. The RV was rocking. Yeah. Hey, if the rockin'. RVs are rocking, don't come a noggin. <laughs> but wasn't let me tell you. like that. <laughs> Every five minutes, somebody was rolling over, and when somebody rolls over, and it's not just a fat guy in the RV, <laughs> whenever somebody rolls over, the whole RV bounces. It's got air suspension or something, I don't know. They think that's kind of humorous, but needless to say, uh, sleeping was a little bit of a challenge last night, and I'm proud to say that we're going to drive for nine or ten hours a day to Chicago, and we are going to get Chicago. a hotel room near Wrigley Field. Yay! No bathhouse, hot showers. <laughs> All right. Yeah, because if you notice, those of you that saw me yesterday, I'm in the same clothes. We all made an executive decision. We were going to skip showers this morning, manage through the smell of all of us, and take showers when we checked in tonight. So I'm glad this is not smell a cam because you would not like the <laughs> effervescence that you would not smell. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Man. But. Moving on down the road, I guess that's it for today. We will see you about the same time tomorrow, where we'll be updating Adventure Day 2. Bye! 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 We're out.